So I like that every year it's always something new and you never know what's coming, but you learn, you learn them and they learn you and you form that relationship and that bond and they know that you love and care about them. My favorite thing about teaching kindergarten is just the growth that you see. Um, I also love the relationships that I'm able to make with my students. Um, I absolutely adore them. I call them my kids um, because they mean so much to me. I have kids that have graduated high school. I go to their basketball games. Um, I'll go to baseball games. You know, I still love, they send me graduation invitations. I still love that. I still keep up with them throughout their school years. Um, and I love being able to teach them to learn to read, knowing that they come in at the beginning of the year and they can barely hold a pencil. They don't know their alphabet, but whenever they leave, leave me, they're fluently reading. And that's just the most fulfilling thing that you could ever ask for. I couldn't see myself doing anything else. <laughs> for sure. Definitely. This is, I know without a doubt, this is where I'm meant to be. We have a student here at Creek Bend who has a very special message for you. Okay. Charlie Joe. <laughs> Hello. Dear Miss Nikes, I wanted to thank you for the fond memories that I spent with you, and I wanted to thank you for being such a great teacher to me and providing such a great school year for me. Even though you're no longer my teacher, you're still one of my favorites. You believed in me before I believed in me. And when you said you loved us, I knew you meant it. You were an amazing kindergarten teacher, and I'm glad you were my kindergarten teacher. Love, Anne Lisbon. Oh, I love you too, sweet girl. Third grade was the best year of my life. You made learning fun, and that's when I fell in love with reading. Your belief and encouragement helped me grow not only in school, but as a person. Thank you for allowing me to be a small part of your life. You have been such a huge part of mine. Love, Charlie Joe. You're so sweet, Charlie Joe. That's so sweet. I love you. That's so sweet. This is why you do it. I mean, you do this for kids like this, um, that even though they grow up and they're in fifth grade now, right? Or six? Oh, you're in sixth grade. Now she's in sixth grade, but she still remembers those small things that we did in kindergarten. So that's what makes it worth it. They know I love them. That's that's one of my favorite things. They they know when they walk in my classroom every day, I can fuss at them, but at the end of the day, they still come back and they give me a hug and they know that I'm there for them. It's very sweet. <laughs> sweet thing.